The sports festival was pretty fun. Yuya just demolishing that ping pong table and the volleyball court was pretty good. But you know what the most dangerous thing was? It was fucking Kaori. How did she send that kid to the hospital? We saw it. She just throws her racket. It's just crazy. She's very klutzy. Kind of cute. Kind of dangerous. Now, the plot's going some weird ways right now. We got to visit the king. We got to save Luna. There's some archer gold that showed up. We have a new master and... In the earth, we have this new Frieza guy that showed up. Remember the girl that she was trying to recruit us for the entertainment industry? I have no idea where this is going. We have, I think, two episodes left. Let's begin today's reaction. So cute. I can't believe we got another pet immediately. Whoa! Why is she here? Cowdy's at our place? Did I miss something? We're studying together? Oh. Oh, how did... Oh. Oh, this is kind of like a date, isn't it? Wait, you know his stats from the other world? Doesn't he have intelligence leveled up a lot too? You would, you would think those skills just transfer over to, I don't know, academics. <laughs> you shouldn't say that. You're just, you're just spoiling hello? Language comprehension skill? What are you talking about? Damn, we walk home together too? Isn't this a certified couple, kind of? I'll teach you. Psych, he just acting dumb so that you'd come over and help. <laughs> I think she realized. Do you want me to help you? <laughs> ah, stop it! All according to plan. Not that Yuya would ever think like that. Oh, I just... Someone was calling me. Does Kaori have some kind of affinity to the other world? She did look a little bit weird when we said uh, language comprehension skill. Kind of lie, is it gonna... What? Bro. Really? He's not gonna lie? This makes it kind of easier to... I don't know, bring the wife who's over, but... Yeah, Isekai. You haven't seen Isekai animes, Kaori? Come on now. Yeah, that's where we got Knight and the Red Pig. Yo, we're just showing her everything. Should we be doing this? Are you gonna conveniently leave out the fact that you changed, you know, physically because of that world? I think she would accept him regardless. But it's interesting that he's kind of just telling her all the secrets right now. Now, would she also be able to like level up? Learn skills? Moju. That is just a pig. The fuck is a moju? Okay. Well, yeah, obviously. You're not a pig? Okay, you're not a pig. You're a moju. Mm. Not just losing weight. Okay, appearance changed. Yeah. I mean, Kaori, don't you remember us in episode one? Confession. No, I think... I don't know about anyone else. Maybe the friends, but Kaori, I think, would accept him no matter what. I mean, she pretty much like, already accepted him before he changed. <laughs> what would happen if Kaori were to die in this world? Like, this is kind of really dangerous. Like, extremely dangerous. Like, 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 you shouldn't be fucking around yet. The more I think about it, like... Imagine she just walks outside the fence, gets fucking clapped, and she's dead. Obviously, it's not that kind of anime, but still. Ooh. Oh, a secret just between the two of us. A lover's secret? I mean... I mean... Oh, come on, no, push forward, come on. Really? You... <sighs> you, uh... He's never gonna make a move, right? All the girls makes a move, though. <laughs> Look at the little otter seal thing. I, oh, it's just straight up Delica? Yeah, I try to kill your daughter. Now I'm working for her. Should you? I, I mean, honesty is appreciated, but I feel like sometimes being too honest like this is, I don't know, kind of dangerous. <laughs> you gonna execute her? No, you won't. No, you won't. Oh? Wait! King actually tried! What? Oh, special. Pretty smart. Pretty smart. This is just a test, right? 
Not Luna tried to kill you a couple episodes ago, but okay. It's okay. We've already made up, but it's just insane. Daughter con. Right? It's daddy's little girl, so he's gonna just bend, right? Look at him. <laughs> the mental damage. Fucking crazy to me. I try to kill your daughter. All right. I recognize you as... <laughs> As her guard now. <laughs> Emotional damage! And... What did he do? Careful. Careful. <laughs> no, I mean, she also took a bath, I think, right? I, that happened, right? Yeah, they, they, they did take a bath. Owen, remember, bath. Don't forget the detail. <laughs> I love how the king gets pissed off and he just... Fucking lashes out on the random furniture <laughs> in the different pots in here. Oh. Oh, with that tongue movement. <laughs> I like this king a lot. He's trying to be serious. I can't take him seriously, though. His actions are ridiculous. The voice acting is actually so good, too. We've been really ghosting him for all these episodes. Will they ever meet? Sleep sheep. Sleep sheep. Bed? Is that blanket and pillow? Did it just drop a blanket and pillow just straight up? Sure, I'm down. It's just... I mean, why am I... Why am I baffled by this? When the previous thing dropped an entire fucking bathtub. Like, like it is what it is. Oh, cat girls. Dog girls. Oh, <laughs> he is a bit of a furry. <laughs> He's excited at the tails. Japan, where is that? Ah, don't worry, it's just a small island somewhere else. <laughs> the classic excuse isekai characters use when they ask, where are you from? That good shit. Probably super rare, right? Yo, I, we've seen this in Campfire Cooking in another world. Salt and these spices are extreme luxuries here. It's gonna be so much money, man. They're gonna lose it. Yeah, we should follow it up and uh, bring some shampoo. Remember, the shampoo sold so hard. I don't know how much that is, but that's probably a lot of money. That's what I said. <laughs> Oh, we got some better salt and pepper. Next time we bring a shampoo bottle, they're gonna lose it. Oh. Little head, little head bow. Wonder what the king will say. Will he accept Yuya? I think he'll try to test him. And once Yuya shows how strong he is, how capable he is, the king's just gonna be on his knees begging him to take Lexia. Is my guess. Luna! I should be probably saying Lexia too, but I don't know. I'm a little bit more Team Luna. Okay. Yeah, she also took a bath. What's up, father-in-law to be? Hey, she did, she did ask. Yeah. No, the, the scoundrel! <laughs> Bro, come on! Watch him do his test now. Funny king. Father, you're embarrassing me. What? Gift? Ah, ah shit. We, we, maybe we have something in the item box. <laughs> Dude, he's, so, he's such a diva, man. You got something though. Give him some salt and pepper. I don't know. What is it? Oh, betting. Oh, we picked up along the way. <laughs> what does that imply? Paradise betting. Because culturally, like, this is probably saying, I want to, like, fuck your daughter in these sheets, right? <laughs> Here he comes, dude. We didn't mean to! No, I want the king and Yuya to fight. Come on, let's go. You can't just show off betting, man. You want to take her to bed. Yeah. No! Not in front of Luna! 
Alright, let's go. Come on. Bring that blade. Yo, where's the Omni Blade at? Yeah? Oh, it's probably from the... It's the magic ceiling thing, right? What the fuck were they? Protect the king! Yo, this is happening so fast. I thought this shit would happen before Yuya got here and then he would be like... I don't know, a heroic entrance. We don't need magic, bro. You got no idea. But this is the prince? I don't, we still don't know his, I don't know, position here. But he is royalty and he said my father, right? So it makes sense. <laughs> Did you see Akatsuki just slowly walk while <laughs> Knight and Yuya just like jumped? Yeah, these guys are jokes. They... Bro, we don't even need a weapon. I thought we might use a weapon. We're just fucking barehanded. Like, too easy. All right. King, are you impressed? Have we earned your blessings? Can we take your daughter to our bedding now? Hmm? Have we? I don't know. <laughs> Luna's like, try to take her away. Come on, King. That was pretty cool, right? No weapons. We're not seducing your daughter. Post credit scene? Yeah, show some respect, father. <laughs> Such a daughter con. Hmm. What is that emblem? What does that represent? Probably their family. Okay, okay, yeah, expected. Bro, that's a lot to ask. We just got here. You want to fucking save your kingdom? All right, fine. We'll do it. I actually like Owen and the king a lot. They're very funny. The king, the way he's such a daughter con, he always fucking uses his sword. This great blade shall slay you. Sometimes he throws a tantrum, starts breaking shit, and Owen just has to take it. This is pretty funny. Now, this older brother, I'm sure he's not going to be much of a third. In fact, his little plan already got it, like immediately destroyed. Like, how, how can they threaten Yuya. And I don't think the series needs to go that far. I think it's just going to be a fun ride of them trying to do some shit. Yuya will do Yuya things. Everything is happy at the end of the day. And the king will be like, all right, all right, you take my blessings. Give me those beddings too. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.